Hey Kingsville, it's Les McDonald here with your Kingsville Beat reporting for the Kingsville Times. Well, COVID-19 has been hard on everybody. It's been hard on our businesses. It's been tough personally. It's been particularly hard on performing artists and all the people that work to support them. Well, thankfully, the Kingsville Music Society has been providing live music. They brought us an amazing concert. Hi, Michelle Law. And I'm John Law, producers of the Kingsville event today. Music Society. <laughs> Kingsville Music <laughs> and today's event. <laughs> today we're celebrating the next installment of Kingsville's Open Streets and for the first time in almost uh, two years we're having our first open air concert with uh, celebrating our Kingsville Music Society and uh, the, the, the memories of the folk festival that uh, you know started back in 2014 is being resurre resurrected tonight. Yeah, it's been such a challenge to not have music during the whole COVID crisis here. And we also realize the artists don't have work, the production people don't have work, all the sound men. And so there's been a whole industry that's really been hurt. And we've been trying our hardest to somehow get started lightly at the beginning when they're, we're allowed to have a little bit of music. And we've done that uh, right from the start with open streets, having four local acts in every week, lightly getting started to one of the bigger shows we're having today. Yeah, we have three acts today. The first act is a local young man named Max Marshall, who's an incredible guitar player and songwriter and singer. And we have Tom Wilson, who's formerly of Junk House, and and Black Black and the Rodeo Rodeo Kings. Who and we've tried to have at the festival many times, but we, yes. we got him here today, which is wonderful. And we also have Whitehorse, a husband and wife couple from Toronto who are indie pop sound, incredible, all, all Juno Award winners. Great music, we've tried to get them here as well. It's been two years and now we have them here. It's a, a registered not-for-profit in Ontario, incorporated in 2013. It's run by a volunteer board of directors and the mission is to present live music in the area and teach people about great Canadian music. We have a few events that we run. We do an annual folk music festival. We do a concert series. We've done open streets with the town of Kingsville this year. And we have a free concert today. And all the proceeds we have throughout the year go towards the May Fund, which is music and arts for youth. And we give scholarships out. We'll be giving a scholarship out today. Uh, this year, we've been very fortunate to be able to give a couple scholarships uh, to high school students going off to uh, arts programs at the university and also to donate some money to some local high schools. So today we have Mr. Jordan Youssef, if you want to come up, from Leamington. So with that, being one of our winners, he's going to get $500. I'm Jordan Youssef. I'm 18 years old. I'm from Leamington, Ontario, so very close to Kingsville. I want to thank the Kingsville Music Society for giving me this opportunity, giving me this scholarship. It's it's really cool. I'm really honored to be one of them who was recognized by some place like the Kingsville Music Society. Yeah, it was difficult at first because, you know, we had a formula and, you know, we built it and, you know, one of the, the things that I said as president is, you know, bigger and better every year, right? And, and we were gaining momentum and, and, and um, everything was growing. Volunteers were growing, the amount of people coming through the gates was growing. We were getting bigger and better acts every year and then COVID hit. But the truth found me it wasn't harmless. But it's really uh, caused us to kind of dig deep into it in terms of who we are, what we want to accomplish, where we want to go with it. I just want to thank all of our volunteers. Uh, come in day in, day out, we wouldn't be here without you. I want to thank the community of Kingsville for everything that you've done. I want to uh, thank the town of Kingsville for your support because, you know, it's been a rough 18, 17, 19, whatever it's been months, and we're back here standing on grounds with live music with people behind us, and that's a tremendous accomplishment. And we wouldn't be here without all of those people. So from myself and our society and our board members, thank you. Well, I can tell you, because I was there, it was an amazing concert. Thank you, Kingsville Music Society. Now, if you got to see the concert, good for you. If you missed it, don't worry. The Kingsville Music Society is going to be bringing live talent at every Open Streets event, okay? So find their Facebook page and follow them for updates. Thanks for watching the Kingsville Beat and for reading Kingsville Times.